So our problem statement is we have multiple ERPs. And when I say multiple ERPs, we're talking about dozens of, of ERPs, uh, the more, majority of them being J.D. Edwards and SAP. But we still have quite a few cats and dogs out there. Um, when, we, when we started this, uh, this global initiative, one of the countries that came out to, uh, to want to jump onto the bandwagon was Turkey. And so we sent some folks out there, uh, and, uh, about maybe six or seven folks. And unfortunately, the Turkey office is about six or seven folks, <laughs> slightly more than that. And the cost of doing it just wasn't, uh, it, it just, the cost value wasn't there. And so we had to uh, back off and say, well, go ahead and go on, you know, keep on using Excel for a while. <laughs> and then, and then part of this multiple year piece, of course, then you have the lack of process standardization, uh, master data, uh, et cetera, and so on. And it contributes to this just amazingly complex environment. Redundancy of efforts and thus costs. And then uh, we're not able to analyze our business across the regions and sectors. Everything, everyone looks at their, they have individual tools that they're using. Uh, we don't use the same type of standardizations in terms of our costs. It's, it's a real challenge. You get, for example, you have folks in Los Angeles at Neutrogena that have very little vision or understanding of how the business is doing in Latin America or Asia Pacific without that standardization. How do they figure it out? It's mostly Excel or at a very high level on corporate reporting uh, that's done at, at month end, but nothing, very little that's actually actionable. Past challenges, three sectors not lined on ERP strategy. I remember, gosh, it must have been 2000, maybe slightly before, when it was announced that the three sectors were going to start standardizing on single ERPs. So, okay, that makes a lot of sense. Well, then the second part of the announcement was consumer was going to go SAP, uh, medical devices was going JD Edwards, <laughs> and then the pharma, pharma sector was going SAP as well. But of course, as consumer and pharma, you know, no affiliation, don't even talk to each other. And I, and I'm just a, a lowly, uh, you know, senior, uh, senior accountant at the time, or senior analyst maybe even, thinking, really? <laughs> Is this even possible? And you can just smell that, the, you know, we're going to revisit this later on. It's just a, it's a remarkable. I'm sure some very intelligent people, allegedly. 